So today I'm talking about a Dodge with the P0038 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a Dodge P0038 code? Well, it's a heated oxygen sensor, heater control circuit high, bank one, sensor two. And what does this mean? Well, there's sensors and they're located on the exhaust and they do two things. The first thing they do is they monitor how much oxygen was burnt off during combustion. And then the onboard computer uses this information to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture that goes into the engine. And then they also have heater elements built in that do a few things to help it go into what's called a closed loop quicker. And the onboard computer Computer's seen a problem with one of these, so it's gonna have to be troubleshooted. No why. And so what are some possible causes? Well, it could be a bad sensor, could be in the wiring, could be a blown fuse, and possibly an exhaust leak. And so keep a lookout for an exhaust leak, because if there is an exhaust leak, it can't throw these sensors off. And so the first thing to do when you get this code is to go locate the bank one sensor two oxygen sensor. Since there can't be some differences, it's really going to vary. It's going to depend on the engine, the year, and things like this. Sometimes there'll be two, sometimes there'll be four. It's really going to vary. For example, here's a 2005 Dodge Ram, and bank one, sensor two, would be right here. So this would be the oxygen sensor that's having the issue. And if you don't have a diagram, then basically find cylinder number one, and that'll be bank one side of the engine, and the opposite of that would be bank two. But if you find the number one cylinder on your engine, and then the second sensor on the exhaust going down would be sensor two. But the first thing to go and do is to locate this bank one sensor two oxygen sensor, also called the downstream oxygen sensor on your particular Dodge. And then once you locate the sensor, the next thing to do is to check out the wiring real good. Be sure everything looks like it's plugged in. There's no loose connections or any damage or anything like that. Basically keep in mind, anything wrong with the wiring, open, short, bad connection, anything like that is gonna cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. Also keep in mind that these are gonna be on a fuse and if that was a blow, then it could cause issues. So that's something to keep in mind. And so if the wiring all looks good, there's no damage or anything like that, everything looks like it's plugged in, the very likely that sensor has just failed, it just needs to be replaced. You can't test it if you want to. I made a video on how you could test these sensors. I'll put a link down below if you need it. But the next thing to do is gonna to be to either test it or replace it. And one thing about these sensors is that sometimes they require a special tool to get back in and get around that wire. They can also make it easier to get off if they're really stuck on there. Sometimes you won't need this special tool if you can get it off and then you can use an open-end wrench to get it back in. It's really going to vary. Sometimes it can be recessed down into the exhaust where you need that special tool to get them back in and get around this wire. Again, it's really going to vary, but basically go and look at it. Be sure you got the right tools to get it off and to get it back in since you might need that special tool. I'll put a link down below if you need this special tool, if you need to see what I'm talking about. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to make a basic video on how you go about fixing a Dodge with the P0038 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If if you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.